Hello and welcome to Sweet Science. Sorry, I'm going to be showing you a uh, run through of uh, transmips. Uh, just type in that in there. You do have favourites up in the top corner here, so if you want to look at them there. But does do most of the things you will probably um, not expect actually from an FTP client. It does FTP, obviously. SFTP, uh, not one that you would think of. Uh, Amazon S3 and WebDAV. Uh, I can't actually log on to um, my FTP at the moment because, well, we've got no internet connection because we've snowed in but still I'll just give you a run through of anyway uh, you can show hidden you can see all these hidden files all things you've got in here it's insane how many there are um, you can have it as a single view with just FTP on it you can have it as double view so you can drag and drop and cross and cross and stuff like that or you can click on here you can go this view like that flow you can go on icon view like I do have it on here you can go for list view you can go for like tabbed view you can go for I've already said this one haven't I still um it's easy it's easy to do things as well because you can actually label each one with your FTP as well which is quite good um you can change file names things like that uh better than most of the ones that I've actually seen because most of the ones you can't change much you, um, you're you limited to what you can uh, I mean with my FTP server on here I can't change anything on any of the other FTP clients I've tried um, so that doesn't work very well but still yeah, you can pause transfers and if you do get a transfer you get this window and you get pause clear and it tells you where conflict between it continue after errors, you can search your transfers um, if you go into preferences see what's in here cloud mm, don't use that rules, advanced um, transfers, here we go I'm not sure Double click action, transfer, edit, edit in external, do nothing, yes, font size, change it, custom editors, dot uh, PSD, views, applications, find it, Photoshop, Photoshop, click OK, use the application for all files, oops. PSD. Okay, and there you go. It's just really simple. Okay, general things on here as well. Uh, you can click on here if your internet's working. Oops. And then you're going to type in your password, and it'll come up with an icon here with the drive of which you would use but because my internet's not working I can't actually show you it in use but still uh, really good application I use it a lot in fact I use it more than most applications apart from Photoshop and Illustrator for numbers and pages etc oh yeah and mail because I open it and screenplay obviously um, but anyway yeah it's really handy actually because um, you can have multiple windows, you can have multiple tabs, so if you've got different FTPs, you can connect to different FTPs at the same one, same time, so you can have one on that one, and then another on this one, and another on that one, and it helps. See, I only have FTP, I don't have SCFTP or anything like that. But still.
too. Um, thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, and check out my other videos. I've got, for example, my mobile me icon, or my how to create how to create a drive icon, things like that. Anyway, thanks for watching, and.